Alexa Pena Vega got emotionally candid on Friday, June 21, when she opened up about the loss of her fourth child that IT hurt, it sucked and it was awful. But we're okay, Alexa, 35, said in a video via Instagram, the Spy Kids alum, 35, and her husband, Carlos Pena Vega, tearily revealed this past April that she gave birth to a stillborn daughter. On Friday, Alexa responded to a fan who asked her how she was doing after the trauma, it's okay to be okay after a loss. We grieved. We hurt. But we were restored and filled with peace, she continued, she and the former Big Time Rush member, 34, were going to name their little one Indy, and she added that the baby will always be a part of our lives, life after Indy will be brighter because she brought us perspective. She brought us closer together. She made us stronger. She helped us grow in areas that needed growth, the actress noted, sharing that Indy was the light in our lives and always will be, Alexa Starr concluded what we would give to have her in our arms now, but we don't want to live in her loss we want to live in her light. God's peace surpasses all understanding. The couple are also parents to sons Ocean, 7, and Kingston, 4, and daughter Rio, 2, having tied the knot back in 2014. Carlos and Alexa previously opened up to what's the gossip about welcoming a fourth child prior to learning their child was stillborn, the Nickelodeon star said in November 2023 that Alexa's pregnancy was tough on him, you lose your best friend. And then not only in those nine months, but after those nine months, she's still gone for a little bit, Carlos said, the duo recently made their first red carpet appearance together following the delivery of their stillborn daughter in late May at the premiere of their film, Mr. Manhattan, thank you, you have successfully subscribed, subscribe to newsletter subscribe by signing up, I agree to the terms and privacy policy and to receive emails from what's the gossip deal of the day snag the sale on this sundress while it's still 30 off. View deal check our latest news in Google News follow us check our latest news in Apple News follow us you have successfully subscribed. By signing up, I agree to the terms and privacy policy and to receive emails from what's the gossip check our latest news in Google News check our latest news in Apple News Alexa explained at the time on social media that going through the stillbirth was hard on both her physical and mental health. This season, I have learned so much about pain with purpose, she shared. On Instagram. Losing Indy was very hard, and then right after losing her, my health declined a lot, and nobody could figure out what was wrong. And it was a very hard season for all of us to navigate, but I don't think I've ever surrendered in this way to God in my life, God, give this pain a purpose. Anytime my body is feeling pain, God, you turn it into purpose, whether it's moving whatever's in my body out, whether it's pushing these emotions through my body. God, like, whatever it is, do not let this pain go to waste, Alexa said.